Hey there, my name is Jenny De Cruz, and today I will be presenting uh, my C Sharp project that has been developed in fulfillment of the course requirements for my web development program at Humber College. So I have created a movie rental system that I call Blockbuster. And here we can see all the movies that have been listed from uh, my movies table in my Blockbuster database. So now the functionalities of this website are that you can create, read, update or delete uh, any of the movies listed here or their rentals which we'll see in a minute. So let's say I want to add a new movie. Uh, I have taken all the information, description and images from IMDB or Amazon. So for let's add a new movie. Um, Life is beautiful. Let's copy this. Add it as a name. It's a comedy drama genre. With this description. And So this one's from IMDB, which way is it? Anyways, let's just Here we go. I'm just gonna copy this address. And now let's say the cost of running is thirteen dollars twenty four cents. Create. So now if we scroll to the bottom, we can see that Life is Beautiful has been added. If we click on it, we can see that the description, genre, and everything else that we entered has been listed over here, including the movie ID, which was the entry ID in the movies table in our database. And let's say we want to update the cost, like any detail, but in this case, the cost of renting this movie, uh, we can just hit the update button. And let's change this to $15. And now if you go back here, we can see that the cost of renting has been changed to $15.24. And in case this we are no longer selling this movie and we want to delete it from our system, we can simply hit the delete button and confirm that we want to delete this movie because it can't be undone. And now if we scroll to the bottom, we can see that Life is Beautiful is no longer listed here. Another feature of ours, like I mentioned earlier, was you can see the rentals. So if we click on um, The Dark Knight, we can see that it has been listed by Jason Mendes from this day to this day. We can add a new movie rental. So let's say Neil Dice has rented this movie from February 10th to February 27th. And let's add it. Then if we go back to Dark Knight, we can see that Neil Dice has been successfully added. Uh, and in case we want to update his renting details, that he wants to extend the time he's renting the movie, we can just come here, hit the update button, change the date and save. So we had hit the update button and now we can see that the date has been changed to 7th March. In case we want to delete an entry, for example, Jason Mendes entry, we can simply hit the delete button here and confirm that we want to delete it. And now if we go back to the Dark Knight, we can see that he is no longer listed. Another functionality is we can search for any of the movies by just searching it in the search bar here. 
So let's see our search for Pulp Fiction. Only that movie appears and when we click on it we can again see all the details with respect to this movie and its rentals. And that's about it for this project. Uh, if you want to see the source code or learn more about it, this is uh, my GitHub repository which can be found on bit.ly forward slash blockbuster project. Here I have explained the project in brief as well as uh, the code consists of the comments for every function to explain what it does. And there's also a section in my readme where you can see how you could clone and run this project. If you want to learn more about the projects that I have worked on in the past, you can visit my portfolio that is bit.ly forward slash Jenny's resume. Thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day.